In the second video, uh, introducing you to the First in Math website, I'm now logging into First in Math with an unassigned account. I am choosing not to share the password in case this account ever does become activated. So here I am logging in. Again, don't let your browser, or I recommend not letting your browser remember your password, especially if you're on a public computer. You certainly want to hit never. So now we're into First in Math. Uh, once you click login, you'll see a picture of a student. Pictures always change, and we're just going to hit go. And now we have the First in Math homepage loading. Here you see the account I used is 19 Astro 91 PA. Astro 91 PA stands for or represents a classroom. The number 19 represents that individual student. So everybody in this class has the password Astro 91 PA. Every student has their own two digit number that is private just for them. Here is the score. You get one sticker or point just for logging in. Here is the team score. So there are 30 students in this unassigned class. Every time I earn a sticker, my team earns a sticker, and below you can see that the school then earns stickers or points. Uh, over here, we have a series of uh, games and tasks for students to perform. I'm going to start with skill sets in this video and move on to others in videos to follow. So if I go to skill sets, these are the most simple, but uh, they build up. As you can see, they build the skill sets one through eight, and they get more difficult as you go. I'll just do a couple demonstrations with skill set one just so you see how the games work. So I go to one, and again, there's three levels in skill set one. So I'm going to start with game one. And the video will load in uh, Flash Player. And here we can see the operations that we're going to be using, an undo button in case we make mistakes. And these symbols show how many levels we need to complete within this game. So I'm going to hit Start. And the operations that are only available in level 1 is adding. So I need to figure out which set adds to 9. So as I click, I get a window. I have to add my operation. You can hear a, a rewarding ding when I get it right. And again, keep going. I'll just so there's a level completed. And now I have a sticker. If I hit start, I can go again and continue getting uh, stickers in my skill sets and earning stars. But let's go home and I'll show you that my score now, I've earned a sticker. If I go back to my skill sets, I can go to one. And you can see I'm still on game one, where I can then continue and play until I unlock two and three, earning me a star for level one. And then I will move on to two and play those three games and earn a star for level two. So there's constant rewards of stickers and points for your team and class, and the stars reminding you of which levels you've completed. Uh, that's all for this video. Come back next time, and there'll be a video for another game in first and math. Thanks for your time.